Hello and welcome everyone into the Boote Boot Camp. My name is Lori Hoy and I am one of the hosts. You will be meeting Paige tomorrow, um, but we both have invited different people here. Our coaches have invited people into this Boote Boot Camp launch group. So basically what I wanna do is to tell you just a little bit about myself because I'm going to start a timer. We are going to promise that we're going to have these videos short, sweet, and to the point so that you can get on with your day um, because time is the only thing that we can't get back. So I definitely want to um, honor your time as well. So anyway, um, I have been a, a coach for three, almost three years. Well, it's not quite three years, two and a half years now. And um, I'm a dance fitness instructor, started teaching Zumba back in 2011, and in 2000, what is it, 18, isn't it sad I have to do the math, 2000, June of 2016, I said yes to uh, becoming a online health and wellness fitness nutrition coach. Uh, and basically the reason why I did, it, did this was for a couple, well I had a couple reasons. One, I when I was doing dance fitness, I was already coaching. I was sharing with people different ways that they could do things to help them become healthier and happier. I was sharing what I was doing nutritionally. I was um, giving them recommendations of things that they can use and try to help them become better um, at health and, and the general well-being of their bodies, okay? and also their minds, okay? So basically, um, one of the things that we do is we host every single month what we call, in our language, a challenge group. Don't really like the name of that because challenge sometimes, ha to me, when you have challenges, you have something pushing back against you, right? And you need to push through that. So I don't always love the word challenge. But you might hear Paige or I say something about a challenge group. Basically what it is, is our challenge groups are full of support, accountability, and community. And those are the th really the three things that we focus in on during these challenges, these challenge groups. Now, we might throw some challenges out at you, like I know I just uh, was talking just the other day to someone about... Um, I'm not a morning person or I always blank, blank, blank. So we might challenge you to start thinking differently. That's what we mean by, that. that's how I think of a challenge. Or it might challenge you to do something different or you know, walk up and talk to somebody that you um, wouldn't normally do or give somebody a compliment. So throughout the process of our groups, we're always helping you to become a better person, period. And if that involves health or if that involves fitness and nutrition then it will right but the ultimate goal is to become an all-around better person okay so what do I mean by support well this group that we host every month is full of other women I don't even think we have any dudes in our groups anymore it's full of other women that are going through the same struggles that you might be going through right Different situations, obviously, because we're all living different lives, but it's kind of like a 24-7, you can pop in, you can put in here, you, you know, uh, something that you're facing that, I mean, is a struggle, and I guarantee you're going to find somebody that's going to have either, has either been going through it already, has already gone through it, or is currently doing, you know, going through those same struggles, okay? So you can always find support there as well as through us coaches, we will support you in your health journey, okay? I don't even like to say fitness journey anymore because it's more about your health and it's all kinds of health. Um, your physical health, your emotional health, and they go together, okay? The other thing that you will, you will receive in this group is accountability. So many times we promise ourselves that, yep, I'm going to start Monday, I'm going to get up early and I'm going to go for a walk or I'm going to stop eating so much junk food or I'm going to make myself go to church every Sunday and you just don't have anybody to say, did you do it? And you will let yourself down quicker 
than anything else. You won't let your friends down, you won't let your families down, but you will break promises to yourselves quicker than anything. You know why I know that? Because I did the same thing. And on occasion, on occasion I still do. So the accountability piece is if you say that you're going to do something, we are here for that reason. We are here to say, did you do it? And when you did it, how did you feel, right? And if you didn't do it, what's going on so we can help you so the next time you don't break that promise to yourself? That's what we talk about when we say accountability, right? So how do we show accountability? All right, so two of the things that we do in here is, is fitness and nutrition. So one of the things that we're gonna ask you to do is we're gonna ask you to share a sweaty selfie, saying that, yep, I did my workout, and you can see it because it's all over my face and my shirt, right? <laughs> as far as nutrition, we're gonna ask you to take photos of the food that you eat so we have an idea of how best we can help you in the next day, right? Um, so, so the accountability is twofold. And then also emotional health. One of the things that we're gonna ask you to do is do some personal development. Paige and I have been doing personal development since we started coaching every single day. And the days that something might get in the way of my personal development, I can tell immediately. Personal development is listening to podcasts or listening to, uh, or reading a book or listening to it. And it doesn't have to be what we listen to because I know Paige and I both listen to things about nutrition, but we also listen to lifestyle things, things that we like, um, that our hobbies are. Um, we listen to self-help stuff, whatever you want to call it. And since we are in business for ourselves, we also listen to those types of things as well, okay? So the final thing I want to talk about, because I only have about a little less, a little less than four minutes, is the sense of community. Basically, to me, these groups, that's what it's all about. We all want to feel welcome and belonged to something or, or um, involved in something. That, we're hardwired that way. We are social beings. And even, even the most introverted introvert still wants, still wants to be included, right? Still, still wants to be asked, even if, even if the thing they're being asked, you know, for instance, if, if a friend calls you and asks you to go out to the movies and you really can't go, it still feels great to feel like you are being included, right? So, um, sorry, I just lost my train of thought. So one of the things that, that I have learned over the two and a half years uh, that I've been doing this and been involved in, in these groups is that there is no other thing more valuable to me than that sense of community. You can pop in here any time of the day, and I know we talked about support. They're pieces of this community. The accountability is a piece of this community. And if you've been trying and struggling for years to get your health on track and you've not tried this, this is one thing that has kept me on track because I know that there are people that I can rely on, not my family, not my friends, because yes, they, you want your family and friends to be there for you, but sometimes that doesn't happen. But you have this community of people, these women that are moms, that, are, that work inside and outside of their homes, that are wives, that are entrepreneurs, that all shape, sizes, colors, eth uh, um, ethnicities, sexual orientation. We're all one. And we are here to build each other up instead of tear one another down. This community has been the game changer in my life for the past two and a half years. And if I would stop today and, and not have this community tomorrow, I would truly, and I'm being all sincere in this, I would be lost. Um, because when you start to take that step to take care of yourself, you will get pushback from those around you that you love and care about. And you will be so um, oh, I, I, I can't even, I don't even know what the word is right now. You will be so surprised at how a group of strangers 
can take you and lift you to the next level. So guys, this group, when we start the Boudet Boot Camp, yes, it's about fitness, it's about nutrition, it's about teaching you about proper supplementation, about how to eat differently and to make your body the machine it should be and work the way you want it. But besides that, is you have a community of women at your beck and call to take you and lift you up when you need it the most. And that to me is more valuable than anything else other than the nutrition piece <laughs> that you will learn here with us. We hope by the end of, we know by the end of this launch group, when you, there's my timer, when you learn all it is that we are going to share with you this week about our group, that you will want to jump in and try it because it is, the, it is the difference, it is the game changer, it is the missing piece, it is the secret sauce, whatever it is you wanna put into that, that statement, then go ahead and do that because it has worked for many, many people, okay? So anyway, that's all I have. I don't wanna keep you any longer. I hope you're having a wonderful Sunday. Stay tuned for Paige. Tomorrow she'll be coming in. Um, we're, I don't know exactly what time every day that we're going to be coming in, but we're always gonna save the video in the timeline. You're gonna get one short video each day throughout the rest of this week. Launch day is on the 14th, and we'll explain more about launch day in the coming days, okay? Have a wonderful Sunday, guys, and uh, I'll talk to you soon.